Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube fam? It's your boy, Joe Fit Johnson, back at it again, bringing y'all some fire content. So if you are new to this channel, this is where we kind of talk about you know, fitness, health, mindset, self-development, you know, bring y'all into my world a little bit, modeling insights, modeling game, entrepreneurial game, business, crypto. I got a wide spectrum over here, you feel me? So we can't, we can't be boxed in. And that's part of what we're going to talk about a little bit today. But today, what I want to talk about, I'm going to give you some insights into the modeling game. You feel me? I'm going to give you some insights, a couple questions that I get asked a lot. And the first question is going to be, so y'all been seeing me in Nike. Y'all been seeing me in Jordan. Y'all been seeing me, you know, over on, in, the, in the ads on the website. And everybody like, yo, can you hook me up with the with the new J's? Somebody literally asked me that because I was a part of like one of the new Jordan releases. Like, yo, can you hook me up with the new J's? Yo, you get all the free Nike. And people think with modeling that we get free clothes. And I thought that too when I first started. But boy, was I lied to. Not lied to, but I had the game bent, twisted, and confused. They don't give model shit. For real. <laughs> For real. Like, especially like the big companies. Like, you would think, you know what I'm saying, no shots at Nike and everybody like that, but you would think these billion dollar companies, you know, would get a model some free gear, you know, at least one piece per shoot. And I'm not saying I'm grateful. We got a nice little day rate. But I mean, if we are models, you might as well trip us out so we can, you know what I mean, model in real life. <laughs> no cap. But yeah, no, nah, we don't, uh, models don't get free clothes. You feel me? I ain't got no free clothes. You feel me? The only time I get free clothes is when I work with smaller brands. Not even smaller brands, like designers and things like that, like that I have relationships with or that are just smaller brands. Like they will actually oop you some gear. Um, but when it comes down to the big companies that are booking you for, yeah, like, nah, bro, they ain't giving you no free gear, bro. I wish. Like, I mean, models, if we out there, like, maybe we can do a petition or something like that. And, you know, I know we grateful for our, our rates and stuff like that, but still. Um, but yeah, no, nah, we don't get we don't get free clear. Now, every model is different. Every model is different. Some models is influencers as well, where, you know, they may get, you know, gift packs and stuff. I have been gifted different things from like YSL and things like that, but I'm not shooting for them. It's something completely different. Um, but I know some of my model friends that, you know, some brands have hooked them up. But it's not like, I don't think, I don't know nobody at, you know, like, I don't know, like Levi's, Nike, like big, big companies. I don't, I don't think I know nobody that's getting geared out. Um, but yeah, that's the insight on that to answer your question. Um, next question would be, what are the cons to modeling? And this is a, this is a, and I'm not, this isn't scripted. This isn't written out. This is kind of just off the dome. Um, first thing I would say, the net 90s. They got 90 days to pay us trash right i know um not all clients take that long shout out to shout out to nike they pay us you know like same week week of um and a lot of you know like private clients and things like that they pay you pretty quick but when you're through the agency and you get booked for big gigs through the agency they got 90 days to pay you so by the time you get paid you damn near forgot that you worked a job you feel me so that's definitely a negative um another negative i would say like just the i guess the grind overall man like i'm i, I definitely would be grateful to have more consistent bookings <laughs> you feel me like i definitely wouldn't wouldn't mind uh but yeah i would say like the 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 unsteadiness of the seasons you got some seasons where you're working and you got some seasons where you're like okay are we modeling you feel me so it's like the inconsistency with that um i would definitely say cons is like when you're a new model i know that i came across a lot of creeps a lot of predators out here a lot of people use the fashion industry to get closer to guys and girls beautiful guys and girls you feel me they'll become photographers so that they can shoot you in your undies or shoot you nude and that's real spill you know from mother agents and I, I i'm laying out the i'm laying out the, the sauce from mother agents to agent b y'all be careful out here y'all protect yourselves don't be no thirsties don't be i mean if you with it you with it <laughs> you will be but if you ain't with it you know what i'm saying hold your integrity there's creeps out here there's photographers out here that are trying to you know what i'm saying take advantage of you so that's definitely uh, a con of the of this industry man um 
I would say also, I mean, it's a lot more diverse now, but I would say, you know, I, I have a lot of friends that have had trouble with like, you know, the body dysmorphia and, you know, um, kind of just like the, the whiplash and just like the, the, the negativity that comes with, you know, the body and the, 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 the feedback and things like that. So I know that times have been changing it's been a bit more but i know especially i mean in the in the women's side i know a lot of my 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 female model friends that um you know they get told that and these are like finely built women but oh they're too big they're like how i mean it depends on what you're shooting and things like that but more body inclusivity um and diversity just in general you know um in terms of people of color booking um guys and girls um what else Con. i mean i think like anything it's political you know i think that yeah it's a lot of politics in terms of getting and working with certain campaigns and brands and things like that but that's with anything you know what i'm saying that's why your network is your net worth you definitely want to you know what i'm saying make sure that you you know what i'm saying networking well and you know working hard and you know what god has for you nobody nobody can you know what i'm saying get in the way of that um but i can't say there's too many cons with it man like it's it's pretty dope it's a pretty dope industry you meet a lot of let's do some pros let's do some pros um pros with modeling man you meet a lot of like i would say one of my favorite things you meet a lot of dope people like i've met a lot of friends creatives um the experiences that you get to have you know what i'm saying whether you're traveling to you know going to new york if you're by coastal or having the opportunity to to travel and model you feel me like i'm about to go to japan i went to london before um i got my, my uh, i got my guy um well, i've got friends that's been in milan germany um south africa there's all type of different markets where you can go and model so that's a cool thing as well as like once you've established yourself as a model and you have a book and things like that you can you can likely get some representation over in a different country and, and model, also model model there which is dope right um so I think that, you know, just the, the people that you meet and the networks that you build, I think that's a power in itself. Like outside of the money, you can really, you know, and outside of modeling, you can you can build relationships and you can do other things. I know a lot of people that have done that as well. Um, I, th I say the experiences as well. Like I haven't gotten paid to do like a, you know, like Sun island trip, but I have friends that have, you know, Aeropostale, they go out to Aeropostale, you know, islands and shoot Aeropostale campaign. My time is coming you feel me i'm you know I, I got i got some time in the game you know i'm black don't crack but i'm just uh, that 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 seems very very lit you feel me so different experiences i know i got to go out to big bear um and shoot a campaign before you know we were snowboarding got to meet dope friends be on sets meet the people that you i've uh met jay-z uh shooting with or doing a fitting for montclair and it was montclair and rock nation and yeah, I was sitting there fitting Jay-Z's unreleased product right there, you know? So just cool experiences like that. Um, pros, getting good good, good payouts, good pay rates, you feel me? Like not many, many jobs where you get paid thousands of dollars a day, you know, whether it's a thousand or a couple thousand or a few thousand, you know what I'm saying? It's nice. And then as you move into film and commercial and things like that, you get, you get royalties. Um, and that's where I'm I'm looking to go next. You feel me? I need to be lights, camera, action, commercial, rolling, airing. Let me get some residuals. And I think that honestly models should get residuals for this. This is a whole nother conversation. I have an idea that I'm not currently working on, but God is working on in terms of how us models can start to get paid residuals using a new technology that I'm not going to talk about because I don't know why you take my idea yet feel me I'm gonna I'm gonna work on this this is something that I've had an idea of for a while but I think models should also get royalties I think just getting paid once and then getting our work used for years eh, not gonna cut it let us let, let us get those royalties just like the tv and the film get them I um I would say that's a con but it is what it is let me think pros Oh, being able to get dressed up in the flyest designer for free. I mean, you get paid to literally dress up in the flyest designer. Like, that's fly as fuck. Um, the experiences, bro. I say, like, just being able to, from fashion shows to, you know what I'm saying, the after parties to the, you know what I'm saying, to the sets to the, you know what I'm saying, 
being in front of the camera like it's it's late no cap um pros oh you get a bunch of free professional photos like i use a lot of my photos for other things you know website things like that so you always have a documentation of just like super dope photos that you can use for anything i guess you know test photos you can use for your website your business things like that which is cool um what else being fly as hell <laughs> yeah literally just getting to be fly as hell being able to be marketable for a long time like whether you're modeling right now like i'll be able to model till i'm 50 you feel me just off of me building the experience my age you know going into different markets as i age like it's definitely something you can always monetize um i think that i think it's a, oh it's also a really good bridge into acting and other things exposure um whether it be television whether it be movies um i know that, that you know that's a lane as well but yeah i think i covered pretty much the pros honestly yeah if y'all have any other questions feel free to drop them below when y'all leave questions that gives me content to deliver that gives me content to, that gives me content to deliver to y'all so don't hesitate to ask questions because i might make a video on it more than likely um so yeah ask questions and uh yeah that's that's pretty much it for today's video go ahead hit the like hit the subscribe tap in with your boy if y'all like this content if this is valuable insight and information because you know what i'm saying ain't too many models that's really you know got this type of insight i've been in the game for a long time i got a lot of insight i know a lot of people i've been asked a lot of questions so yeah i think this is valuable insight so hit the like hit the subscribe rock with your boy game